best selection of beautiful and unique home decor in the region. Easy Casa Decor in Riadoso. For years, people from all over have come to Casa Decor for the best selection of rustic, real wood furniture, beautiful decor from the southwest and beyond, and quality outdoor furniture and accessories that are built to last a lifetime. At Casa Decor, they have over 10,000 square feet of showroom for everything you need. Casa Decor opens seven days a week from 9.30 to 5 at 1214 Meacham Drive in Riadoso or online at casadecorriadoso.com. Proud supporter of local high school sports. Hey, CVE members, have you scheduled your no-cost home energy audit? If not, we're getting close to fall and cooler weather. It's time to sign up. Call 575-746-3571 to get your name on the list for a free home energy audit. Weather stripping, new door sweeps, minor repairs, and much more. Start saving money and keep that purchased air in your home. Central Valley Electric is happy to partner with Green Metal Energy for this valuable audit. Again, 575-746-3571 to sign up. Call now. It's basketball season on the High Plains, and your Eastern New Mexico University Greyhounds are back on the hardwood. Join the Greyhounds as they take on arch-rival West Texas A&M Thursday, December 2nd, with a 5 p.m. tip-off for the women and a 7.30 p.m. tip-off for the men's game. Don't miss out on all of the high-flying excitement. Tickets are only $5 for adults, and kids 8 and under are free. Go to GoEasternAthletics.com for more information. Greyhound men's and women's basketball, all in. ENMU Roswell offers high school students the opportunity to get a head start on their college education journey into health care. Through the Allied Health Careers Pathway, high school learners can enroll in dual credit courses that introduce them to a wide range of careers that include emergency medical technician, paramedic, nursing, occupational therapy, respiratory therapy, medical assisting, phlebotomy, and nursing assistant. Start your health care career path at ENMU Roswell. Contact your high school counselor for more information. Maybe your AC unit needs a little tender, loving care. If you don't know where to turn, then you don't know Jack. In fact, they're downright funky. Let the boys at Fergie's Plumbing and Heating get your AC unit ice cold, just like some of my lady friends. Don't let any fool make you lose your cold. Fergie's Plumbing and Heating. If you don't know Fergie, then you don't know Jack. 622-2660. Fergie's. If you're missing a tooth or several teeth, a dental implant may be the ultimate solution. Implants look and feel so much like real teeth that you probably forget you have an implant. Maupin and Brown Dentistry is one of New Mexico's most experienced implant providers with literally thousands of implant patients who are absolutely delighted with the results. Call Maupin and Brown surprised how affordable implants can be. Moppin and Brown, your choice for experienced, state-of-the-art dentistry. Mays Lumber has all the hard-to-find hardwood you've been looking for. Oak, cherry, walnut, poplar, and maple. Plus, hard-to-find exotic woods like purple heart, zebra wood, ambrosia maple, black limba, and bloodwood. Perfect for that one-of-a-kind gift piece or table. Get ready with Formica and Wilson Art Countertops in 12-foot or custom length with installation available. Make it happen at Mays Lumber, 115 South Virginia in Roswell, serving southeastern New Mexico and beyond since 1934. Oasis Computers has been Roswell's trusted source for home and small business computers for over 30 years. And they continue to be your best resource for computer repairs, operating system upgrades, web root managed antivirus, special orders, and more. Oasis Computers is now open from 8 to 1, Monday through Friday, to better serve you. Service calls by appointments and after-hour appointments are available, too. Stop by Oasis Computers at 1703 North Garden or call or text 575 625 59141 for even faster service. This is Renee. Happy to be here. She's not some influencer. She's more of a groundbreaker, turning her four acre lot into a little slice of heaven behind the wheel of a John Deere 1 Series tractor. Renee runs with us because the most important job is the next one. That's all I got. Nothing runs like a deer. Hear Renee's story at deer.com. Stop by Pecos Valley Equipment in Artesia and Roswell or visit us online at PecosValleyEquipment.com. Have you noticed the days are getting shorter? This is Jim Gill from Roswell Seed Company. 
I know it's kind of hard to tell, but we're on the downhill side of the year, so every day is a couple of minutes shorter than the one before, even though your plants need plenty of food and water to keep them healthy, like those globe willows that are turning yellow. A good dose of the right fertilizer will make them bright green again. No matter what the problems you're having, we probably have a cure at Rawls and Seed Company, but come see us soon, because winter's coming, you know. Ladies and gentlemen, So Easy Sewing finally has our most popular sewing machines and sergers back in stock. We have the Zest, our entry-level machine on sale for $149. We have the Amazing Jazz 2, which boasts a 12-inch throat on sale for $799. And our number one selling Verve sewing embroidery combo machine on sale for $999. All machines include lifetime instruction on the use of the machine. Hurry in to 200 East College Boulevard in Roswell to claim your new machine before they are gone. So Easy Sewing. You've never had it so easy. White coming to you live along with Coach Gilbert Lucero. Going to be calling the afternoon matinee here between the Moriarty Pintos and our own Goddard Rockets. Looking for an exciting match here. Goddard Rockets coming off a big win on the road over Valencia High on Thursday. So Moriarty comes in at three and five on the on the season, and so. This will be a, a contest between Coach, what, what I'm expecting to be two pretty good basketball teams. Moriarty with a lot of size down there, don't have their uh, heights and weights right in front of me here, but some good looking kids there on their roster. Going through the lineups here for Goddard, real quick, we'll get you starters as soon as we get there. So Coach, this will be our last kind of tune up here before we hit the uh, the holiday tournament. We'll have a, a few days off after this game, and then we'll come back on the 28th for three straight days of, of all day basketball. KSVPTV.com, of course, will be your local coverage for, for all of those games. And um, I know we're both looking forward to that. My, my normal uh, uh, host, the guy that does the color for us and the play-by-play uh, -play and the color, uh, Coach Deck, he's out of town for the holidays, so I want to give a shout-out to Coach Deck. Uh, so Coach Lucero going to fill in, and we're going to do do our best here, Coach. Yeah, I'm going to try and give it up, my, give it my all. <laughs> all right. Well, Coach, I, I know that 
you know, going back a, a few nights ago, you know, we, we played Roswell High, lost a, a thriller at the buzzer. But, Coach, you, you had to like the, the energy our kids played with. And also, Coach, you know, you can see that we're starting to get a little continuity, you know, within our, within our team, with our lineup. And so, you know, exciting to see. So today it looks like we're going to have uh, Cannon, Kidos, Aragon, Schooley, and then James Torres is going to be our, our starting lineup. So going with a, a quick lineup here More tonight. Of a lineup. Sure. You know, and that's one thing about Coach Messis. Uh, Coach, he tries to, I think, let everybody on on the team play, develop his bench. You know, and you know when we get to district, we should we should be a well seasoned team. Aragon going for the tip, back to Cannon, and Coach Aragon. He's kind of our do-it-all guy. He rebounds, he scores. You know, he's he's big on the defensive end. Schooley inside to Aragon Good with a nice little spinning hook shot there. Got her off to a quick lead. Elijah Kidos with the good hands there. Save there from from Cannon. Moriarty running a little bit of motion offense. Schooley dishes off Torres with the shot. Count it. It's good. That's a good jumper right there. See early in the game, Goddard playing more of a press. Long three on the way. Count it. It's number 21 from Moriarty. Cuts the lead, 4-3, 6.40 to play. Kidos with the ball, off to Cannon. Last touch by Moriarty, out of bounds. Gonna stay with Goddard here. Aragon on the inbound, off to Schooley. Aragon loses the handle, tries to get it into Schooley. Moriarty off and running. Good defense inside there. Cannon comes away with the rebound. Cannon looking to press the action. Has Kiros all alone. Can't finish. Aragon with the rebound. He can't finish. Moriarty brings it across half court. Three-pointer on the way. Moriarty with the rebound. Cannon comes away with it, so Moriarty doing a good job on the glass there, but can't finish. Cannon a little out of control there. Oh, and Moriarty turns it right back over, so. I still think that would have been a contestant shot. Good hustle out of Kidos right there. Coach, he's he's sneaky good down in the in the paint. Golly, Moriarty not having any luck. They finally get one to fall in the paint. Getting a lot of good looks there. Torres on the wing. She loses it. Nice finish there. A lot of contact underneath. Hard, hard fall for Damian Aragon there. He seems to be okay. Now 
Got a sub here, coach, for Moyarty, number 23, Michael Magoff. All right, Schooley brings it in, pulls it up, kicks it out. Aragon with the ball, going strong in the paint. He draws the foul. He's going to shoot, too. And, Coach, if there's one thing, you know, that I know Coach Mestis is – is working hard on, but really the, the only thing, Coach, I, that we really have just got to improve on, uh, honestly, is the free throw shooting. You know, we do a great job. The kids are, they go strong in the paint. First free throw's good. We get to the line a lot. We just don't always convert on those. And, you know, come district time, that'll be the difference in wins and losses. And But I, I really always, you know, like the energy our kids play with. You know, we're an up-tempo team, and you can tell the kids are well-conditioned. And All right, here we go. Coach going to run the full-court trap there. Moriarty gets a three off. By Cervantes, the sophomore. Schooley going strong. Oh, he finishes. Count it with the and one opportunity. There's a big time move from Mitchell Schooley there. All right, so Romero going to check in for Cannon here. And Mitchell. Finishes the three-point play. A little slow getting over on the rotation there, Coach. We're trying to trap. Moriarty gets the easy bucket. Kitos with the ball across to Aragon. Aragon into the paint, finds Schooley. Schooley dribbles out of trouble, kicks out to Kitos, foot on the line. That's an air ball. Moriarty off and running. Little jumper. Moriarty with the rebound and they finish. It's 11 to 11 with three and a half to go here in the first period. Moriarty gonna show a little pressure defense here. Ball's loose on the floor. Moriarty comes away with it. Pinto's off and running. Kidos steals it right back. He's going coast to coast. He can't finish, but he'll go to the line and shoot two. That Euro step will get you, coach. Yeah, it's tough. It's a tough little Euro step Kidos has got there. So he misses the first free throw. One more to come. Second free throw's good. Rockets back on top, 12 to 11, with three minutes to play here in the first. the steal. Gonna call the charge there. Took a long time to make the call. Wasn't sure how that was gonna go. offensive foul right there so the ball will go right back over to the Rockets. Kiddos with some tough defense there. All right, Moriarty with the timeout. Yeah, coach, we both both teams playing pretty solid defense so far for sure. Um, 
But Moriarty coach knocking some shots down and, and Moriarty doing a really good job on the offensive glass. We're gonna have to kind of, we're gonna have to play tougher on, on, the, on the boards down there. They're getting a lot of, you know, second looks, third looks and we're also playing a quicker lineup, coach, as well, you know, so be interesting to see as the game goes on how that plays out. Moriarty with some with some long guys in, in the paint for sure. All right, so back on the floor for the Rockets, Cervantes, Romero, Quitos, Aragon, and Scooby. Aragon to inbound. Kidos on the wing. Off to Cervantes. Aragon in the paint. Cervantes shoots, can't finish. Moriarty, number 44, with the rebound. Scooley gets a hand on it. And they're going to get him with the reach in foul there. teams here playing some really good defense yeah coach and and the officials are letting them play you know not a not a lot of whistles so far only the second team foul for goddard there three-pointer on the way and it's good moriarty takes the lead 14 to 12 with 210 to go in the first period schooley off to romero romero Kicks it across to Kitos with a good look. Aragon, nice job in the paint. He gets the rebound and the score, so. Oh, man. Had a point blank shot right there. They missed it. Give our guys credit for battling that one out. Ball goes out of bounds, so. Goddard ball with 140 to go here in the first period. Tie ball game, 14 all. Cervantes to Aragon, nice pass in the paint. Romero with, with a chance line. for three. He gets the bucket and he'll go to the line. free throw, Goddard back on top, 17-14. Nice looking runner there from number 33. So 17-16. Kiddos kind of lost a handle on it. Yeah. Too. Coach, some of these were just pushing the action maybe a little more than we need to. Nice cut in the lane right there. They're going to get Aragon with the foul. He gets the block. Free throws up and good. Second free throw high off the iron. Shooters bounce. Somebody already here with their first lead of the game. 18 17. Good steal. Yeah, back to Moriarty, three-pointer on the way, count it. 21, he's a hot shooter, coach. Definitely, I think he's three for four right now, if I had to guess off the top of my head. All right, Aragon got to get it across half court. Romero has it, he's going strong in the paint. He finishes. 
So 15 seconds to go here. Moriarty up by two. I would assume they're going to hold for the last shot of the quarter. Dangerous pass, four seconds. That's going to be out of bounds. Moriarty back court. So coach with nine tenths here, we've got a we got a chance here for a pass and gonna have to catch and shoot fast. Let her rip. It's away. Oh. All right, so tough shot there. We're at the end of one. Moriarty up 21-19. High score and affair. We'll take a break. We'll be right back. Did you know that most burglaries occur during the day? Why you ask? Most of us are at work, leaving the burglar to go unnoticed. Did you know the average loss from a home burglary is over $2,200? Not including one's loss of emotional security in their own home. Avoid being a burglar's target market and get a monitored security system from Zenith Security Services, all for around a dollar a day. Wouldn't you agree that an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure? Call Xena Security Services today, 626-3521. Good morning, honey. Hey, I have to pick up the kids from school this afternoon. Can you call... A home invasion can happen anytime, even when you're at home. Protect your home and the ones you love with whole home security from Zenith Security. The security experts at Zenith Security can monitor your whole home 24-7. So they're ready whether you're there or not. Call Zenith Security Services, LLC at 626-3521. That's 626-3521 and get whole home security with Zenith Security Services, LLC. All right, we're back. Going to start the second period here. Moriarty with the possession arrow, so they're up 21-19, action-packed first quarter. Moriarty shooting the ball lights out so far. Looks like we got some new faces in the game now. We got Rhett Price, Noah Reese, Cervantes, Laj Romero, and Jarek. Yeah, Jarek Mendoza coaching. He's been, he's been hot lately. They're going to get him with the foul here right away, but coach, he's a dynamic player for sure, man. He's he, he kind of does it all for us, and, you know, he's really emerging this year, uh, only a junior, and, you know, last year we saw him on the JV, and, man, he was he was scary good with the ball in his hands, and but he, he really is, you know, coming on. I think he's going to be a special player before it's all said and done. All right, so Moriarty, one of two there on the free throws. Romero bringing it down. Off to Mendoza. Romero had a chance there, turned it over though. Moriarty bringing it in the paint. Kick it out. Oh boy, they're wide open underneath. Reese gets a hand on it. Again, Moriarty just doing work on the glass so far. And they're going to go back to the free throw line. So 15 foul on the Rockets, first team foul on Price. Free throw is no good. Second one falls. Moriarty up by four, 23-19. Romero bringing it up. Off to Cervantes. Cervantes is going to dribble through a double team. Lucky not to turn that one over. That's going to be off Moriarty's foot there. Cervantes off to Mendoza. Mendoza going to drive the lane, pulls it up. Cervantes over to Price. Price to Romero. Romero looking to get the ball in the paint to Reese. Price at the top. Yeah, and they're going to get Romero with the push off there. And Going to get some subs here, coach. Looks like 
Esquivel going to check in. Aragon and Schooley. All right, so Mendoza going to take a seat. Price going to take a seat. And Romero out. And that's, Coach, that's that's one of, the, you know, going to be one of our assets, I know, down the stretch, is that we are going to have a deep bench. All right, Moriarty right away goes to the glass. Aragon comes away with the rebound. Schooley brings it up. Aragon in the paint to Reese. They're going to get him with a travel. A lot of, a lot of contact down there. A little confusion here, Coach, on the defensive end. Reese gets back and, and actually gets a big block. Schooley goes to the basket, can't finish. We're going to get a blocking foul. See, Coach, what do we have here? Looks like they're going to call the foul on Goddard. That's going to be on Reese. And that's going to be a one and one now for Moriarty. In the bonus here. is it Cervantes gets the rebound he's going to give it off and let Aragon bring it down Schooley gets it to Reese it's top Reese loses it gets it off to Schooley Schooley hits the floater Cuts it to two here with five and a half to go. Schooley almost gets the steal. Moriarty trying to press, Coach, and they, they do a pretty good job of it. There's the steal. Get a timeout here. Coach Mest is going to talk about it. Got her down six to Moriarty, 27 21, 4.55 to play. We'll take a quick break. We'll be back. We know you love your car, and at Big O Tires, we love your car too. We know it's so much more than just how you get from here to there. That's why your locally owned Big O in Roswell and Carlsbad is proud to help keep your car in top shape with our trustworthy service, quality products, major tire brands, and some of the best deals in town. And don't forget, we have easy and affordable financing options for nearly any budget. As members of our community, we know what's important to you and your car. Big O Tires, the team you trust. Where can you find the best selection of beautiful and unique home decor in the region? Easy, Casa Decor in Riadoso. For years, people from all over have come to Casa Decor for the best selection of rustic, real wood furniture, beautiful decor from the southwest and beyond, and quality outdoor furniture and accessories that are built to last a lifetime. At all Casa right, Decor, they back. have over 10,000 square feet of showroom for everything you need. Casa Decor opens seven days a week from 9.30 to 5 at 1214 Meacham Drive in Riadoso or online at casadecorriadoso.com. Proud supporter of local high school sport. All right, we're back. Cervantes going to inbound here for Goddard with 4.55 to go. Coming out of the timeout. Escavel with the ball going strong. Kicks it out to Aragon over to Schooley. Trying to get the ball to Esquivel on the little baseline cutter there. Moriarty knocks it out of bounds. Cervantes to inbound. Aragon, Aragon, right Aragon underneath. Reese gets the rebound. Can't finish. Cervantes with the rebound. Schooley has the ball off to Esquivel. 
Three seconds in the lane on Goddard, so coach will turn it back over. All right, Nunez going to check in here. So Reese will take a seat. Oh, Aragon with the steal. Escobar, Escobar actually came away with it. Aragon poked it out. Nice job out of Zeke there. Schooley has it in the corner. Off to Cervantes. He draws the foul. That'll be on the floor. Sixth team foul on Moriarty, so not in the bonus yet. Nunez over to Schooley. Schooley breaks him down. Floaters on the way. Escavel going for the rebound. So ball out of bounds, last touch by Moriarty. Shot by Nunes with the three on the way. It rattles out. Moriarty with the rebound. with the foul there it'll be on the floor but it'll be a one and one opportunity for Moriarty. <laughs> Nunez subs out Romero comes in. Free throws good. Second free throws good. Schooley off to Escavel. Escavel trapped in the corner. He throws it away, gets it back. All right, here we go. Moriarty gonna trap us and Aragon just loses the handle. Three pointer on the way, it's good. Moriarty's hot here. Moriarty up 32-21 with 3.15 to go. Paul Moriarty with the foul there. They kind of had us in the corner though, Coach. Romero didn't didn't have much to do there. He yep. was he was in a bind. Yeah, Moriarty playing some tough defense here. <laughs> All right, so a big one and one opportunity here. Price gonna check in for Esquivel. This is where we'll make our money right here, coach. <laughs> Free throws off, Moriarty with the rebound. Aragon gets a hand on it, Moriarty. Golly, that ball, I don't know how. It, Anyway, they did manage to, to corral that. They get the bucket. Romero turns it over. Ball's loose, but Moriarty comes away with it. So ball out of bounds, last touch by Goddard. Romero going to take a seat. Kito's, Kito's going to check in. 
There, Cervantes with the hook shot gets it to fall and he'll go to the line. Chance for a three point play here. So, Big 44 are going to check back into the game for Moriarty. Seventh team foul on Moriarty, second foul on number 23. Free throws up and it's good. So we cut the lead to 10. Looks like we're gonna set up a trap here, maybe coach. Oh, look like a travel there. Ball's out of bounds. It's gonna stay with Moriarty. Gonna get a timeout here by the Pintos. We'll take a quick break and we'll be back. Hey, CVE members, have you scheduled your no-cost home energy audit? If not, we're getting close to fall and cooler weather. It's time to sign up. Call 575-746-3571 to get your name on the list for a free home energy audit. Weather stripping, new door sweeps, minor repairs, and much more. Start saving money and keep that purchased air in your home. Central Valley Electric is happy to partner with Green Metal Energy for this valuable audit. Again, 575-746-3571 to sign up. Call now. With two minutes to go here, Goddard down by 10. Moriarty going to inbound under their own basket. Price gets the block, and they're going to call him with the foul. And that'll be the 10th foul on the Rockets. So Pinto's in the double bonus here for the rest of the way with two minutes exactly to go in the half. Big 44 at the line. He'll shoot two. First free throws on the way, and it's good. Second free throws up, and it's good. Schooley with the ball. Moriarty with the trap. Aragon cross half court. Schooley thought about the three. Nice drive inside. Can't finish. Cervantes goes up strong. A lot of contact. No foul. Moriarty off and running. Last out of bounds. Last touch by Goddard. Schooley with the good hands there. Stopping a two on one. Pintos drive the paint. Price comes down with the rebound. Schooley off and running. A lot of contact. He'll go to the line. He, we're in the one and one, coach. So, chance to knock down a couple here with the clock stop. Down by 12. Cooley hits the first one. <laughs> Second free throws on the way. It rolls in. It's a 10 point game. Kiros with the steal. Escavel in the paint. Off to Cervantes. Loses a handle. Loses the handle on that. Moriarty's off and running. They got numbers three and one, and they finish. Fifty-eight seconds and 
And counting here, Schooley with the ball off to Kitos. Kitos thought about the three, pulled it back. Cervantes at the top of the key, off to Kitos. Esquivel in the paint, out to Price. Schooley in the paint, Esquivel kicks it out. Cervantes three on the way, it's off. Esquivel fighting for the rebound. They're gonna call jump ball. I thought we might get an over the back call there. Give Esquivel credit for doing work in the paint. Possession gonna stay with the Rockets with 33.1 seconds to go. Diego to inbound. Schooley kicks out to Quitos. Over to Cervantes. Nunez off to Price in the paint. Price can't handle it. Moriarty's got a guy out front. And they're gonna call a technical foul for slapping the backboard on that. So Moriarty gonna go and shoot two here. They missed the layup, but Nunez tried to pin the ball and ended up just hitting the backboard. So Moriarty will shoot two, coach, and then they'll also have possession here with 17 seconds left in the half. First free throws up and good. Second free throws good. All right, so Aragon. Kitos, Price, Cervantes, and Schooley in the game. Moriarty gonna inbound here with their biggest lead of the of the afternoon, up by 14. Ten seconds. Three seconds, I don't know if they're gonna get the shot away. They do, long three, it's off. So Goddard gonna go in at the half here, trailing 14, Pinto's 40, Goddard 26. We'll take a break and we'll be back. It's basketball season on the High Plains, and your Eastern New Mexico University Greyhounds are back on the hardwood. Join the Greyhounds as they take on arch-rival West Texas A&M Thursday, December 2nd, with a 5 p.m. tip-off for the women and a 7.30 p.m. tip-off for the men's game. Don't miss out on all of the high-flying excitement. Tickets are only $5 for adults, and kids 8 and under are free. Go to GoEasternAthletics.com for more information. Greyhound men's and women's basketball, all in. ENMU Roswell offers high school students the opportunity to get a head start on their college education journey into health care. Through the Allied Health Careers Pathway, high school learners can enroll in dual credit courses that introduce them to a wide range of careers that include emergency medical technician, paramedic, nursing, occupational therapy, respiratory therapy, medical assisting, phlebotomy, and nursing assistant. Start your health care career path at ENMU Roswell. Contact your high school counselor for more information maybe your ac unit needs a little tender loving care if you don't know where to turn then you don't know jack in fact they're downright funky Ferlicious. let the boys at fergie's plumbing and heating get your ac unit ice cold just like some of my lady friends don't let any fool make you lose your cool fergie's plumbing and heating if you don't know fergie then you don't know jack 622 2660. 
If you're missing a tooth or several teeth, a dental implant may be the ultimate solution. Implants look and feel so much like real teeth that you probably forget you have an implant. Maupin and Brown Dentistry is one of New Mexico's most experienced implant providers with literally thousands of implant patients who are absolutely delighted with the results. Call Maupin and Brown today for an evaluation. You'll be surprised how affordable implants can be. Maupin and Brown, your choice for experience, state-of-the-art, Art Dentistry. Mays Lumber has all the hard-to-find hardwood you've been looking for. Oak, cherry, walnut, poplar, and maple. Plus, hard-to-find exotic woods like purple heart, zebra wood, ambrosia maple, black limba, and bloodwood. Perfect for that one-of-a-kind gift piece or table. Get ready with Formica and Wilson Art Countertops in 12-foot or custom length with installation available. Make it happen at Mays Lumber, 115 South Virginia in Roswell, serving southeastern New Mexico and beyond since 1934. Oasis Computers has been Roswell's trusted source for home and small business computers for over 30 years. And they continue to be your best resource for computer repairs, operating system upgrades, web root managed antivirus, special orders, and more. Oasis Computers is now open from 8 to 1, Monday through Friday, to better serve you. Service calls by appointments and after-hour appointments are available, too. Stop by Oasis Computers at 1703 North Garden or call or text 575 625 59141 for even faster service. This is Renee. Happy to be here. She's not some influencer. She's more of a groundbreaker, turning her four acre lot into a little slice of heaven behind the wheel of a John Deere 1 Series tractor. Renee runs with us because the most important job is the next one. That's all I got. Nothing runs like a deer. Hear Renee's story at deer.com. Stop by Pecos Valley Equipment in Artesia and Roswell or visit us online at PecosValleyEquipment.com. Have you noticed the days are getting shorter? This is Jim Gill from Roswell Seed Company. I know it's kind of hard to tell, but we're on the downhill side of the year, so every day is a couple of minutes shorter than the one before, even though your plants need plenty of food and water to keep them healthy, like those globe willows that are turning yellow. A good dose of the right fertilizer will make them bright green again. No matter what the problems you're having, we probably have a cure at Roslyn Seed Company. But come see us soon, because winter's coming, you know. Ladies and gentlemen, So Easy Sewing finally has our most popular sewing machines and sergers back in stock. We have the Zest, our entry-level machine on sale for $149. We have the Amazing Jazz 2, which boasts a 12-inch throat on sale for $799. And our number one selling Verve sewing embroidery combo machine on sale for $999. All machines include lifetime instruction on the use of the machine. Hurry in to 200 East College Boulevard in Roswell to claim your new machine before they're gone. So Easy Sewing. You've never had it so easy. Did you know that most burglaries occur during the day? Why you ask? Most of us are at work, leaving the burglar to go unnoticed. Did you know the average loss from a home burglary is over $2,200? Not including one's loss of emotional security in their own home. Avoid being a burglar's target market and get a monitored security system from Zenith Security Services, all for around a dollar a day. Wouldn't you agree that an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure? Call Xena Security Services today, 626-3521. Good morning, honey. Hey, I have to pick up the kids from school this afternoon. Can you call... A home invasion can happen anytime, even when you're at home. Protect your home and the ones you love with whole home security from Zenith Security. The security experts at Zenith Security can monitor your whole home 24-7. So they're ready whether you're there or not. Call Zenith Security Services, LLC at 626-3521. That's 626-3521 and get whole home security with Zenith Security Services, LLC. We know you love your car. And at Big O Tires, we love your car too. We know it's so much more than just how you get from here to there. That's why your locally owned Big O in Roswell and Carlsbad is proud to help keep your car in top shape with our trustworthy service, quality products, major tire brands, and some of the best deals in town. And don't forget, we have easy and affordable financing options for nearly any budget. As members of our community, we know what's important to you and your car. Big O Tires, the team you trust. 
Where can you find the best selection of beautiful and unique home decor in the region? Easy, Casa Decor in Riadoso. For years, people from all over have come to Casa Decor for the best selection of rustic, real wood furniture, beautiful decor from the Southwest and beyond, and quality outdoor furniture and accessories that are built to last a lifetime. At Casa Decor, they have over 10,000 square feet of showroom for everything you need. Casa Decor opens seven days a week from 930 to 5 at 1214 Meacham Drive in Riadoso or online at casadecorriadoso.com. Proud supporter of local high school sports. Hey, CVE members, have you scheduled your no-cost home energy audit? If not, we're getting close to fall and cooler weather. It's time to sign up. Call 575-746-3571 to get your name on the list for a free home energy audit. Weather stripping, new door sweeps, minor repairs, and much more. Start saving money and keep that purchased air in your home. Central Valley Electric is happy to partner with Green Metal Energy for this valuable audit. Again, 575-746-3571 to sign up. Call now. It's basketball season on the High Plains, and your Eastern New Mexico University Greyhounds are back on the hardwood. Join the Greyhounds as they take on arch-rival West Texas A&M Thursday, December 2nd, with a 5 p.m. tip-off for the women and a 7.30 p.m. tip-off for the men's game. Don't miss out on all of the high-flying excitement. Tickets are only $5 for adults, and kids 8 and under are free. Go to GoEasternAthletics.com for more information. Greyhound men's and women's basketball, all in. ENMU Roswell offers high school students the opportunity to get a head start on their college education journey into health care. Through the Allied Health Careers Pathway, high school learners can enroll in dual credit courses that introduce them to a wide range of careers that include emergency medical technician, paramedic, nursing, occupational therapy, respiratory therapy, medical assisting, phlebotomy, and nursing assistant. Start your health care career path at ENMU Roswell. Contact your high school counselor for more information maybe your ac unit needs a little tender loving care if you don't know where to turn then you don't know jack in fact they're downright funky let the boys at fergie's plumbing and heating get your ac unit ice cold just like some of my lady friends don't let any fool make you lose your cool fergie's plumbing and heating if you don't know fergie then you don't know jack 622-2660. If you're missing a tooth or several teeth, a dental implant may be the ultimate solution. Implants look and feel so much like real teeth that you probably forget you have an implant. Maupin and Brown Dentistry is one of New Mexico's most experienced implant providers with literally thousands of implant patients who are absolutely delighted with the results. Call Maupin and Brown today for an evaluation. You'll be surprised how affordable implants can be. Maupin and Brown, your choice for experience, state of the art dentistry. All right, we're back here at ground zero. Moriarty Pintos leading the Goddard Rockets by a score of 40 to 26. I'm Coach White here with Coach Lucero. And Coach, we were just saying, man, it would be really nice if we had a like a, a food sponsor up here, man. We could give some great shout outs to the local restaurants if during the games they wanted to hook us up with a burrito and a drink. Oh my goodness. Coach, that we, would up we, our commentary level at oh, least five I, can, points right there. Can you imagine? I, I would have so much more energy. <laughs> I bet Coach Deck would go for that too. All right, Coach, different lineup now coming out here to, to start the half. Looks like we're going to have Mendoza, Schooley, Reese, Aragon, and Zapata on the floor here. So Moriarty sticking with their same lineup that they started the game with. we had the turnover out of bounds going to stay with Moriarty Zapata with the good defense there got a hand on the ball so nice little dribble drive there 44 couldn't hang on to it down in the paint going to be out of bounds Goddard ball 
Schooley brings it up, breaks the press. Mendoza trapped in the corner. Ball kicked around on the floor. It's loose. Moriarty comes away with it off to Reese. Reese. Well, I beg your pardon, Coach. Had a whistle there. I, and I did not hear that. They're going to say the ball was out of bounds. So Moriarty with the ball going to inbound. Gosh, I thought Reese had a had a breakaway there just all by himself. I thought we were going to see the tomahawk dunk. <laughs> all right, number 10 kicks it out to 21. 21 with the drive. Reese gets the block, the rebound. M Mendoza bringing it down, kicks it off. Zapata with the jumper, way off. Moriarty gets the rebound, and they're going to get Schooley with the foul. That'll be his third foul. First team foul. So definitely going to need to keep an eye on that. Schooley comes running in, knocks the ball away. Going to stay to Moriarty. Moriarty inbounds. Goddard with the full court press here. Number 10 with a nice dribble. Oh boy, a lot of contact there. Schooley does get the rebound. He kind of got hammered. Schooley, three. Oh, that ball rattled all the way around the rim. He couldn't finish. playing tight defense that's going to be his fourth foul so he picks up two quick fouls here coach in the first two minutes of the third quarter Romero checking in for school here yeah Elijah Romero going to come in well coach down by 14 we're going to have to definitely turn the heat up a little bit on the defensive end but not what we wanted to see there. Romero gets the steal. Oh, and we're gonna we're gonna get another cheap foul there. Aragon. So the ball's loose on the floor, and Romero couldn't quite handle it. Moriarty came away with it, and Aragon just on a hustle play, coach kind of overran himself there and. So four quick fouls against Goddard. We've got him in a bind here, and 10 comes away with it. And Coach, he is, he is quick, isn't he? He really is. Man, he's got some good handles, some good speed. And we're already looking to set something up here. So ball out of bounds. Last touch by Goddard. Going to stay with Moriarty. Aragon going to take a seat. Price comes on. Twenty-one gets a good look at it. Price runs the rebound down. Romero going to bring the ball up. Moriarty drops back. Romero kicks out. Price three pointer on the way. Reese gets the rebound and the putback. So Goddard with their first points here of the quarter, cutting it to 12. Oh, Price, nice job on the defense there. Reese brings it up. Romero. Oh, I don't know. Going to get Romero with the charge there. That's a tough one, I'm, and I'm not in a good position to see what exactly transpired right there, but we're sure picking up a lot of fouls here quick in the third quarter. 15 foul already, zero fouls for the Pintos. Down by 12. I like the energy, but we're going to have to going to have to keep an eye on these fouls here, Coach.
So Moriarty brings it down off to number 10. Ten's their speed guy. Really hard to handle off the dribble, but Price, once you get in the paint, that's a whole nother story, Coach. He's a he's a 6'3 kid, but man, he is long in the paint. Price with a shot in the paint there, can't get it to fall. Moriarty off and running. That's going to be a two-pointer, long two. So Moriarty with the bucket, 42-28, 4.08 to play. Cannon with the ball. Underneath, Zapata finishes, quick bucket. Nice assist for Cannon there. Good job finding the open guy. Moriarty across half court. Little jumper on the way. Cannon with the rebound. Breaks the press. Cannon going strong. Going to draw the foul. And Coach, we'd love to get to the free throw line and shoot some fouls here with the clock stopped and cut into this lead a little bit. First free throw is good. 33 checks into the game. Number 10 going to take a seat. We got Escobo in now for Zapata. Yeah, got us on a lane violation, coach. All right, so free throws no good. Lane violation, Moriarty ball. They're going to have to hurry. And they do break the press here. Cannon on the ball. Boy, nice work there off the dribble. Big 44 catches and scores. for three. Count it. Goddard staying with the press here. Oh boy, they're going to get, looks like they're going to get Cannon with the foul. They reach there, I believe. Yeah. Well, I like it, Coach. We're playing aggressively. Going to be the sixth team foul. Cut the lead down to 10. Reese gets a hand on it. Oh, we get the steal. Reese goes up and scores. He fell asleep on the play. Mendoza grabbed it in the corner, kicks it into Reese, and Reese just instinctively caught it and scored. Boy, and Moriarty right back down the floor for a quick two. Price gets a hand on it, but it still goes in. Reese, long pass to Reese, knocked out of bounds by Moriarty. Going to be Goddard ball. Aragon checks in the game. Price going to have a seat. So Aragon, Esquivel, Cannon, Reese, and Mendoza in the game for Goddard. Reese in the corner, going strong. He's going to go to the basket. Can't finish, gets his own rebound and a bucket. Goddard cuts it to eight, and it's a full court we press got now. Down here by Oh boy, that's a silly foul right there. Don't want to foul him. He's all by himself. He gets the easy bucket and we pile into him. So he'll go to the line with a chance for the three point play. That'll be Cannon's second foul, but more importantly, that's our seventh foul with 2.22 to go here in the quarter. Free throw is no good. Aragon with the rebound. And coach, you gotta like the energy here. And you can kind of you can kind of see the game starting to turn in our favor. Cannon with the three. Rims in and out. Gets his own rebound. He gets the put back. So eight-point game, but coach, we're pouring it on him with the defense here. 
Boy, 44 is just a machine in the paint down there, Coach. We've, we've got to get a body on him. Going to get a timeout here. We'll take a quick break, and we'll be right back. Mays Lumber has all the hard-to-find hardwood you've been looking for. Oak, cherry, walnut, poplar, and maple. Plus, hard-to-find exotic woods like purple heart, zebra wood, ambrosia maple, black limba, and bloodwood. Perfect for that one-of-a-kind gift piece or table. Get ready with Formica and Wilson Art Countertops in 12-foot or custom length with installation available. Make it happen at Mays Lumber, 115 South Virginia in Roswell, serving southeastern New Mexico and beyond since 1934. All right, so out of the quick timeout here, got her down by 10, 152 to go in the third period. Rockets with 17 fouls, Pintos with one, so Coach, it may come down to a, a free throw contest for Moriarty. Dangerous pass there. Mendoza corrals it. Aragon has the ball. Esquivel drives the paint, kicks it out to Reese. Aragon. Taking our time here. We got the floor spread out. Aragon going strong in the paint. Tough shot. He gets it to fall. Oh, all right. So Coach Moriarty brings it down. Can't get the shot to fall. Mendoza gets the rebound, and Moriarty with the one of those cheap fouls right there that if you're a coach, you don't want to see. Well, Coach, we've cut it to eight here. Moriarty was up by as much as 14. We've cut it to eight with 113 to go, and we've got the ball. Again, you know, our, our defense is kind of setting the tone here in the second half. Reese going strong and one. And that's the kind of plays we need to cut into this lead. Is yeah, absolutely, Coach. Be able to take shots with no time on the clock. Free throws good. Lead down to five now. So five point game. So Goddard on a nice run here. Going to stay with the full court press. There you go, Moriarty. Oh, we must have we touched that. Now, I didn't see that. I think they just threw that away. Yeah, they're going to talk about it because, I, Coach, I did not see anybody touch that ball. The, the Pintos just... He passed it and there was nobody there. I don't believe we touched that ball. I don't believe so. All yeah, right, they, they change the it. Around. Nice job. Coach Mestis is uh, having to get a little wound up down there, but gosh, got to get that right, Coach. So 58 seconds to go. Got her down by five. And we're on a serious run here. Reese with the ball. Kicks it out. Mendoza thought about it. Out to Cannon, over to Aragon. Aragon drives the paint strong, can't finish. Esquivel tries to save it, steps on the line, gonna be out of bounds, Moriarty ball with 41 seconds to go here. Goddard pouring the defense on, don't want a foul in this situation, coach. That is a ticky-tack call, I tell you. But Moriarty gonna go to the line, and that's the danger here, coaches. We, we've, we've had all the fouls. That's our eighth team foul. Gonna be the third on Cannon, I believe. Yeah, really all the fouls we could give there. Yeah. Well, and that, that wasn't much, you know, but. And they do hit the front end of the one and one there, so. Moriarty on top by six here, 51-45, 39 seconds to go. In the third period, second free throws on the way. Splash, it's good. All right, Cannon's got the ball, brings it up, breaks the press, no problem. He's going to go coast to coast, can't finish. And one. Gets fouled and one. So 
29 seconds to go here, coach, and we've got a chance to cut it to four. All right, Diego Nunez is going to check in. Damian Aragon going to get a breather here. Free throw rims in and out. Got to be careful, Coach. I'm going to say it again. You don't want to foul in this situation. Moriarty playing for the last shot of the half here, or the quarter, excuse me, third period. Reese goes for the steal. Oh, that should be a, a double dribble. They're going to call a foul. Man, I don't know. Well, I do know he called a foul. They're going to go to the line, and they're going to say it's a shooting foul, so he'll shoot too. And Coach Moriarty, pretty solid from the free throw line. So they'll go back up by six here with the chance to still shoot one more free throw with 10 seconds to go. Free throws up and it's good. 54-47, 10 to go. Cannon off to Mendoza. Mendoza loses the handle, picks it up. Cannon with a long three air ball. <laughs> Lucky that we didn't get called for a foul there. So at the end of three, Pinto's 54, Rockets 47 will take a quick break. Oasis Computers has been Roswell's trusted source for home and small business computers for over 30 years. And they continue to be your best resource for computer repairs, operating system upgrades, web root managed antivirus, special orders, and more. Oasis Computers is now open from 8 to 1, Monday through Friday, to better serve you. Service calls by appointments and after-hour appointments are available, too. Stop by Oasis Computers at 1703 North Garden or call or text 575-625. 9141 for even faster service. This is Renee. Happy to be here. She's not some influencer. She's more of a groundbreaker, turning her four acre lot into a little slice of heaven behind the wheel of a John Deere 1 Series tractor. Renee runs with us because the most important job is the next one. That's all I got. Nothing runs like a deer. Hear Renee's story at deer.com. Stop by Pecos Valley Equipment in Artesia and Roswell or visit us online at PecosValleyEquipment.com. Okay, we're going to start the fourth period here. Rockets with the possession. Down 47 to 54. Coach, we were down 14 at one point, so we've cut it to seven here. Got to like the energy. We're really making it happen on the defensive end. Reese with the three there. Can't get it to fall. Ball last touch by the Rockets. Cannon couldn't quite corral that one. So for the Rockets, Mendoza, Reese, Schooley, Cannon, and Aragon in the lineup. Goddard still with the full court press right here. Now number 10 for Moriarty has the ball. Mendoza's on him. But Coach Moriarty has some really nice ball handlers. These kids are pretty slick. Now they don't have 44 in the game, Coach, and he scored most of their points tonight from the paint. Three-pointer on the way. Reese gets the rebound and he's fouled that'll be on the floor 15 foul for the pintos so aragon will inbound it all right gonna get a sub here Kitos checks in for mendoza Schooley off to Kiddos, gets it to Pry, or I'm sorry, gets it to Reese. Reese with the three, he's fouled. Did they count it as a three or a two, Coach? I never saw a signal, and he did get hammered. All right, going to get a carry call, so 
Rockets going to get the ball right back. Moriarty taking a timeout. So, Coach, the fourth quarter barely underway here. 55 seconds gone. And Goddard's cut the lead to four here, 54 to 50. We're going to take a full timeout, and we'll be right back. Have you noticed the days are getting shorter? This is Jim Gill from Roswell Seed Company. I know it's kind of hard to tell, but we're on the downhill side of the year, so every day is a couple of minutes shorter than the one before, even though your plants need plenty of food and water to keep them healthy, like those globe willows that are turning yellow. A good dose of the right fertilizer will make them bright green again. No matter what the problems you're having, we probably have a cure at Roswell Seed Company, but come see us soon, because winter's coming, you know. Ladies and gentlemen, So Easy Sewing finally has our most popular sewing machines and sergers back in stock. We have the Zest, our entry-level machine on sale for $149. We have the Amazing Jazz 2, which boasts a 12-inch throat on sale for $799. And our number one selling Verve sewing embroidery combo machine on sale for $999. All machines include lifetime instruction on the use of the machine. Hurry in to 200 East College Boulevard in Roswell to claim your new machine before they're gone. So Easy Sewing. You've All never right. had it so easy. We're back. Did you know that? Seven minutes minutes to play. Rockets with the ball. Cannon across half court. Oh my goodness, that pass was high. <laughs> Reese went way up to get that one. Kitos to Aragon. Aragon to Reese in the paint. Count it. 52-54. Pinto still on top. But Goddard with all the momentum here, Coach Lucero. It's really swung in our favor here. Reese has really got it going here. Yeah, Re Reese is on fire, and Coach, we're really playing great defense here. Again, you want to be careful. We have nine fouls, so anything past this will be the double bonus. Kids still playing really aggressively, though. and they are going to call the foul here. Looks like they're going to get Noah Reese with the foul. So Moriarty to the line. They'll shoot two. All right. They're going to call that on Cannon. And that will be Cannon's fourth foul. So something to keep an eye on there. And Moriarty as well, if they've shot free throws, Coach, they miss one right there, and they're going to be big from here on out. Two-point game right now. Second free throws on the way. He misses it as well. Reese with the rebound off to Aragon. Aragon off to Schooley. Schooley. Oh, man, what a timeout. Timeout of the year right there. Schooley's off balance. Matt Coach Mesta sees it and Quick gets the timeout. Whoo, boy, saved us a turnover there for sure. So 30-second timeout. We'll stay live here. Coach, what are your thoughts, you know, right here about this, this second half so far? Well, I think that um, we're cutting into the lead here. Reese is really getting us going. Our defense is playing great. Just got to stay away from fouls. If we stay away from fouls throughout this, we can. Yeah, and coach, they're calling the they're calling it really close here, you know. And as aggressively as we're playing defense, it makes it it makes it tough on the full court press. But honestly, that's where we're having the success. You know, we're already having a little bit of a tough time with that, and so. You're right. We just have got to. We've got to play our game the way they're calling it, and and we're going to have to be careful, you know, because we do have the ten team fouls, whereas Moriarty only at five. All right, so we're live here in the action. Kidos tries to pass it to Cannon, throws it away. Moriarty gets the easy layup there. Lead back up to four. Well, and Moriarty, Coach, they've got some really fast kids. I mean, we've, we've said it all day here. Man, their skill guys are tough. All right, so they're going to call a foul on the floor on Moriarty. But now, Coach, they, they've got a few guys, number 10, number 21, number zero. And, man, those kids can really, really run. Their best post player, number 44, he's been on the bench for a long time, Coach, and you know, he's the guy that did most of the damage in the in the first half. So it'll be interesting to see if they're just resting him for the stretch run or what's going on. Well, Coach, with us cutting into the lead, I mean, 
Might want to keep him on the bench for a second there. Well, it looks like he's going to check in right here. I may have just jinxed us, gosh. Well, long lull in the action. A lot of discussion down there with the scorer's table, but 44 is going to check in. Schooley to inbound. Off to Reese. Reese with the step back three. He misses. Aragon with the rebound. Oh, tries to get it to Reese. Reese didn't handle it. Again, you don't want to foul right here. So Goddard down by four. Oh, Moriarty just about turned that one over. Oh, and there you go, 44 into the game, coach, and he's a machine in the paint. Schooley off to Reese, Reese to Cannon, Cannon. Oh, that's a kick ball. Little delay call there, but definitely a kick ball. So gonna be Goddard ball here, Schooley to inbound. to Mendoza. Mendoza surveys the floor over to Schooley. Schooley in the paint. Reese, nice catch. Can't finish. Aragon goes up strong. He's fouled. He'll shoot two. And coming down this close, these free throws are going to be big for us. Yeah, absolutely. So Aragon at the line here with 4.35 to go. Got her down by six. First free throws on the way. And he didn't hit anything on that one, Coach. Second free throw on the way. He misses that one as well. Moriarty comes away with the rebound. Zero off and running. Aragon, great job hustling back. Reese with the ball. He gets hammered. That should have been an and one. Got to hurry up and get back. So it's a four-point game here with four minutes and change to play. Great effort, though, by Aragon. He misses the free throws but comes back on the other end and gets the turnover. That's going to be a turnover. Schooley forces the turnover over in the corner. Great job, Mitchell Schooley. Esquivel going to check in. Damian Aragon going to take a break. So 3.52 to go. Pentos 58, Rockets 54. So Moriarty setting up a little half-court trap action. Long three there from Cannon. It's a jump. Oh man, how about that Mickey Mouse stuff right there? That's going to be the fifth foul there on Schooley, I believe. Inconsistent there, I, I have to say, but. So it looks like they called the foul on Esquivel, coach, and maybe I missed something. I, I thought they had called Schooley for it, so he, he was the guy defending the ball closely, so maybe they called something away from the play. First free throw is good, though. Second free throw is good. Lead back up to six. Nice pass into the paint. Cannons fouled. He's going to go to the line, coach. Now that will be the seventh team foul on the Pintos. Got Aragon and Romero going to check into the game here. Free throws long. 
All right, so Esquivel is out. Romero in. Second free throw on the way, and it's no good. Looks like they're going to call a lane violation, so it wouldn't have mattered anyway. Kiros checking in. Cannon checking out. 3.26 to go. Pentos clinging to a six-point lead here. And, of course, Schooley guarding the ball. He's got to be careful. He has four fouls. Moriarty going to run some clock here, Coach. Oh, my goodness. If that's a foul, then, oh, an attack. Boy, oh boy. I am not sure what transpired there. That is the softest foul call maybe of all time though, Coach. I, I must have missed something again on that one. Not what we needed with two minutes and change to go here, 2.57. He said an elbow during the dead ball, coach, and and so I, I didn't I didn't catch a number on. The technicals on who, coach? I couldn't hear it. Uh, on number zero, we don't have a zero in the game. So they have posted player number zero with his fifth foul. Number zero on our team's Jarek Mendoza, but he wasn't even in the game. Moriarty misses the first free throw. They sent in a kid that wasn't. I'm not sure here. <laughs> we'll try to figure it out. He missed both free throws. Wow. Oh, I guess a double technical on both number zero for Moyarty and Reese. Okay, so now Reese at the line. Something you don't often see, a double technical. And we missed the free throw as well, coach. One more to go. He drains the second. Who was the original foul on though, coach? So it had to be on Moriarty because now we have possession. Both teams in the double bonus here. Coach, I don't think I've ever been more confused no, in my life. No, I, I am not, I'm not <laughs> sure and of course, the officials have on mass, so you, you really can't tell what's called. Romero with a nice drive to the lane. Can't finish, but he'll go to the line. And we should be in the double bonus, Coach, according to the scoreboard here. Also of interest here, now number zero for Moriarty. That was his fifth foul, Coach. Now in the old days, they would buzz him out from the scoreboard. They didn't do that, but they did post it as his fifth foul. Romero hits the free throw. Big free throw there. Chance to cut the lead to three. Free throws on the way, and it's good. Coach Mestis with the quick timeout. We'll take a break, and we'll be right back. Did you know that most burglaries occur during the day? Why you ask? Most of us are at work, leaving the burglar to go unnoticed. Did you know the average loss from a home burglary is over $2,200? Not including one's loss of emotional security in their own home. 
avoid being a burglar's target market and get a monitored security system from Zenith Security Services, all for around a dollar a day. Wouldn't you agree that an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure? Call Zenith Security Services today, 626-3521. Good morning, honey. Hey, I have to pick up the kids from school this afternoon. Can you call? A home invasion can happen anytime, even when you're at home. Protect your home and the ones you love with whole home security from Zenith Security. The security experts at Zenith Security can monitor your whole home 24-7. So they're ready whether you're there or not. Call Zenith Security Services, LLC at 626-3521. That's 626-3521 and get whole home security with Zenith Security Services, LLC. All right. We're back live. In the fourth quarter, two minutes, 47 seconds to go. Rockets down by three to the Pintos. Moriarty to inbound. Goddard with the full court press. We've got him trapped in the corner. 21 breaks the press. He's fast, has been all night. There's his guy, 44, standing on the corner. And he gets the bucket. Romero brings it down, kicks it out for Reese. Reese misses the three, a lot of contact. Romero with, with, the, with the rebound. All right, and it looks like we're gonna have an injury timeout here, Coach. So we'll take another break with 2.23 to go. We know you love your car, and at Big O Tires, we love your car too. We know it's so much more than just how you get from here to there. That's why your locally owned Big O in Roswell and Carlsbad is proud to help keep your car in top shape with our trustworthy service, quality products, major tire brands, and some of the best deals in town. And don't forget, we have easy and affordable financing options for nearly any budget. As members of our community, we know what's important to you and your car. Big O Tires, the team you trust. All right, so we're back live. Reese going to take a break. So on the floor, Aragon, Kidos, Cannon, Schooley, and Romero. Aragon to inbound. Schooley in the corner, has the ball. Off to Aragon. Aragon to Schooley. Schooley going strong, kicks it out. Cannon with the three on the way. It's good. What do we have here? I'm not sure what that was, Coach. Uh, no, a long break in the action, but Moriarty going to inbound here with two minutes and change to go. And you, the last thing you can do is foul. It, golly, they're going to go to the line and shoot two, and I know Coach Mestis is just holding his breath right there. We're playing great defense. You don't want to let these guys get back to the line. Now, Coach, I'm going to go ahead and say it. These guys shot lights out, free throws the first half, but they've been a little iffy the second half, so maybe putting them at the line isn't the worst thing. That's what we're going to hope for here. First free throws on the way, and it's off. We've got their number, Coach. All right, Price going to check in the game. Keto's going to take a seat. And Coach Price is money down in the paint, man. He is just, if you bring the ball in the, in the paint, he's probably going to block it. So he's in to rebound right here. But second free throw, and he bounces it in. Three-point game with two minutes to go. Schooley off to Aragon. Aragon cross half court. Off to Cannon. Cannon kicks it out. Schooley makes a great catch. Whoo, coach. That was a high pass. All right, Romero with the ball. Moriarty with the man down. We've got numbers. Schooley, three-pointer on the way. He can't get it. 33 for Moriarty. Gets the rebound. 143 to play. 63-60. Moriarty with the lead. All right. 
right, they're gonna run some clock. We're gonna have to turn it on here, Coach, and it, it may come, to, oh boy, he double dribbled. No way. That's a double dribble. Today, tomorrow, and next week, that would still be, in my opinion, I really thought we had him. He called a foul on Price, man. All right, coach, so we're gonna have to, gonna have to do some work here. He's long again, coach. All right, Reese gonna check back in. Price gonna check out. So he gets the back half. Two 127, game. yep. Four point game, Schooley with the ball. Aragon, gotta get it across half court, off to Schooley. Schooley to Romero. Romero with the sure hands, off to Aragon. Cannon with the drive, little floater, can't finish. There's the steal. We've got them, got numbers. Oh, Romero couldn't hang on to it. Schooley a little bit strong, down four, 59 seconds. No reason to panic here. We've got timeouts. Oh, we've got them in the corner. We've got them. Moriarty with the timeout with 55 seconds. So coach, we'll take a quick break. We'll be back. Where can you find the best selection of beautiful and unique home decor in the region? Easy, Casa Decor in Riadoso. For years, people from all over have come to Casa Decor for the best selection of rustic, real wood furniture, beautiful decor from the Southwest and beyond, and quality outdoor furniture and accessories that are built to last a lifetime. At Casa Decor, they have over 10,000 square feet of showroom for everything you need. Casa Decor opens seven days a week from 9.30 to 5 at 1214 Meacham Drive in Riadoso or online at casadecorriadoso.com. Proud supporter of local high school sports. Hey, CVE members, have you scheduled your no-cost home energy audit? If not, we're getting close to fall and cooler weather. It's time to sign up. Call 575-746-3571 to get your name on the list for a free home energy audit. Weather stripping, new door sweeps, minor repairs, and much more. Start saving money and keep that purchased air in your home. Central Valley Electric is happy to partner with Green Metal Energy for this valuable audit. Again, 575-746-3571 to sign up. Call now. If All right, 55 seconds, Moriarty to inbound. Oh, man. And they do get the ball in. We're going to have to foul here, Coach, with 44 seconds. We don't have to foul. Schooley with the bucket. It's a two-point game with 39 seconds. What do I know? We don't need to foul. We'll just steal it. Mitchell Schooley with, with the bucket. Big time. So, Coach... We're going to take a time out here. We'll stay with the action. Big time pressure for Damian Aragon to start that whole sequence there. Oh, my goodness. He is flying around the court. Well, Coach, and our defense has been setting up our offense the whole second half. And, you know, we really have created a, a lot of problems for Moriarty here. The only, the only success that they've had, Coach, is just when they break the press, they get it to their post down there in the on the elbow. And I don't think he's missed one. You no, know, he's all been night. he's been pretty solid, and he makes his free throws as well. So, big 44. He's done work down there. So, we'll want to keep an eye on him. But you can bet we're going to be all over him right here. So, looking at the scoreboard. It shows that we have five timeouts and Moriarty has four timeouts. I don't, I don't believe that's accurate, Coach. But how would you know? I haven't, I haven't kept up with it. So, all right, here we go. So we're going to double, double team 21. Moriarty gets it across half court. All right, not a bad strategy here. Aragon fouls right away, gonna put him at the line. 
We just need him to miss one, coach, and we're in we're in business. A lot of time, 33 seconds. First free throws on the way, and it's no good. That's like missing a PAT with 10 seconds to go, Coach. You just can't do that. Cannot. All right, Coach, we're in business. Get ready to rebound here. Second free throw on the way. It's good. 33 seconds, just what the doctor ordered. And Moriarty steals the ball, Coach. That's not what we wanted. 26 seconds, we're gonna have to make it happen fast here. And Romero, he does foul. So 21 going to go back to the line with 21 seconds. We got to hope he misses both shots here. A lot of time, though. A lot can happen in, in 20 seconds in basketball. He does get the first free throw to rattle home. going to Goddard here so down by four clock is stopped Aragon to inbound Moriarty going to stay with the pressure going to give us an opportunity here we break the pressure Schooley off to Mendoza in the corner shots on the way it's off ball is loose Moriarty comes away with it wild pass oh, oh he walked. walked that's a walk my goodness, four seconds to go, coach. Down by four, Moriarty to inbound, and I'm, I'm disappointed there. That, that was a blatant walk. All right, 2.3, coach, and Moriarty still with the ball here, so they basically just have to roll the ball in, and that'll do it. All right, so tough game here at ground zero. Moriarty comes in and steals one away, coach. 66-62, great game here, hard fought all the way. Moriarty with some, with some good looking players, coach, showing a lot of, a lot of speed and doing a good, a good job coming and, and getting a win on the road. And coach, we, we just, uh, you know, truthfully didn't, didn't play as well as we needed to play and you know that's that's part of it the good the good thing is is we've got a bunch of games coming up and plenty of time to work and and get better and and kind of figure things out we've been a little bit up and down but coach I still you know I like our team chemistry and I know that coach Mestis is a great coach and I know they'll they'll figure this out and get our guys ready to play so Coach, I've enjoyed it today. I want to say thanks to KSVPTV.com for, for putting the broadcast out. Best in the business. Give a shout out to our guy down there, Jan Richards, one of the biggest sports fans in all of Roswell. Uh, Mr. Richards comes and supports every sport that we have and has done it for a long time. Thank you, Mr. Richards. Tanner Todd, that makes this all possible. He's the man behind the scenes here with the with the cameras that, that puts the whole show on for us. So thank you, Tanner. And so for Coach White and Coach Lucero, we'll see you again. And Coach, it'll be holiday tournament time. Oh, yeah. All right, signing off.